and to the community at large. I think we've heard enough, Mr. Chairman. I was told I'd have a chance to... That's enough. The court will now render a decision. Well, look, you said I could speak. He said that's it! Are you deaf? Let's finish this <laughs> thing. I don't think it's fair. I'll tell you what's fair or what's not. Leave me! Tell those to shut up. Hey, shut up, you! to listen to any more of this. Point of parliamentary procedure. Don't screw around. They're serious this time. Take it easy. I'm in pre-law, man. Thought you pre-med. What's the difference? Ladies and gentlemen, I'll be brief. How do you think he's up to? The issue here is not whether we broke a few rules or took a few liberties with our female party guests. We did. Well, you can't hold a whole fraternity responsible for the behavior of a few sick, perverted individuals. Or if you do, then shouldn't we blame the whole fraternity system? And if the whole fraternity system is guilty, then isn't this an indictment of our educational institutions in general? I put it to you, Greg. Isn't this an indictment of our entire American society? Yeah. Well, you can do what you want to us, but we're not going to sit here and listen to you bad mouth the United States of America. Gentlemen! You're not walking out on this one, mister. You're finished. I'm calling your national office. I'm going to revoke your charter. And if you wise guys try one more thing, one more, I'm going to kick you out of this college. No more fun of any kind. My father was in Korea, see. He wasn't a flyer. He was um, in the infantry, and he was an officer, of course. Born an officer. How does it feel to be an independent, Schoenstein? How does it feel to be an <laughs> Niedermeyer? What did he say? Hoover says they won't even let us enter a float in the homecoming parade. Some stupid zombies get to ride a pile of Kleenex down the street. Rah, rah. Hey, look! 